Hi, my name is Olaya Janad. Hi, my name is Romario C, and we're part of the ICA's Teen Arts Council. And today we're going to be interviewing Gustave and Octavio. Also known as Ostimios. Um, in most of your figures, they're a shade of yellow, I've noticed. What's the reason for that? It's one of the characters of our paintings. And when we start to, to try to find our own style of drawing, we find the, the yellow too, the yellow color. And we just believe that it's really beautiful and strong color that we can use it. And it's good for identification too, so people can see and realize that it's on us. It was more like that, more identification and the power of the yellow. And it's, pure, and it's a very magic color, very pure. How was it like growing up as teenagers in Brazil? You know, we, we grew up in the scene that we play a lot in the streets. Okay. Like we create a lot of uh, toys and stuff. Okay. And it was very creative uh, period of our life. Uh, no. I was a b-boy. Yeah. Oh, check you out. Yeah. No. 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 <laughs> okay. Well, we know that when you guys create your pieces, it's based off of dreams. Now, how do you guys um, work together to make those dreams come into reality? Very natural. Just to have the same dream. Yeah. How do you have the same dream? Yeah, I don't know. It helps us grow up. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know the, how to explain yeah. this too. But yeah, it happens. So it's very natural. So you guys like wake up and you like tell each other what you and dreamt like, about? We believe in the same thing. Oh. We believe in the same thing, we, we get the same inspirations in life and yeah, try to communicate with the people in this way. Like, in your artwork, what do you want your audience to learn from? Depend of the kind of each one. Yeah, depend on how open, they are open. If you are open to feel that. It's very uh, specific for each person. So they are open to see or not to see, feel or not to feel, if you want to do that. Some people passing here, even they don't look, but someone really see it and stay and look. It all depends on the person. Yeah, yeah. it depends on the person. Perry McGee was somebody who really inspired you. Why is he so influencing? Because he came in Brazil in 93. I think in that time we didn't receive any uh, visits from yeah. any partners. Mm -hmm. He's one of the first. He was the first. Yeah, come sure, there and so say, yeah, and go it's leave by only, his art. Uh, it's wow. not only for us, it's for the whole scene. Yeah. It's very important. Yeah. What yeah. he's never done. He really he has his own a lot. style. You know? And he opens a lot of doors. Yeah. He's one you know, of the first start to go to the big shows and museums and galleries. And, yeah. Really bombing a lot in the city. His own style, different style than the other. Yeah. Very important for the whole scene. Now, um, when we were first introduced to you guys, we, um, they told us that you guys were street artists, but then we found out that you guys don't like to be called street art. So what do you guys call yourselves? Or I mean, people can call how they have one the ones yeah. to call. We really don't care. Yeah. You know, because it's the most important thing is to have something in a city or in a museum, in a gallery. Or do what you like to do, yeah. and have fun. We grew up in a, in a scene, in the back scene that was, we call graffiti what we do. Mm -hmm. You know, letters, so you guys call it, you guys think this yeah, is like for us, speedy? Yeah. Okay. But this name Street Art come out a few years ago. It's something new. Yeah. Um, for like any upcoming artists that are young that wanna like get out there, what quotes do you have for them? Just belief. Belief. Yeah. And, and magic. What you like it? Yeah, and go for it. You know, like when you, one time you believe. I mean, one time you see what you want, this is most very important to see what you want. Because a lot of people is, is kind of, I don't know what I do, I don't know what I like it. Yeah. You know, it's good to know what you like it, what you want to do. And fight for this. Just believe and go for it. Because, you know, like... You respect the others. Yeah. And you arrive you where you want. It. Yeah, mm -hmm. always. Is it possible you guys can teach us any Portuguese phrases? Yeah. The Dutch ones or the... No, it, doesn't ones, ones. it doesn't matter we to me. We have kids watching this. Saudade is, is a very beautiful name. Saudade? Saudade. Saudade. What does that mean? It's like missing. It's like miss. Miss something. When you miss something. Okay. Saudade. When you miss somebody, you say, Eu tenho saudades. Eu tenho saudades. Estou com saudades. 
Estou. Estou. Não, estou. Estou. Com. Com. Saudades. Saudades. Well, that concludes our interview today. Um, again, we'd like to thank you guys for agreeing to do this with us. You're welcome. Yeah. And we hope you enjoy the rest of your time here in Boston. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Right. Thank you.